so ewo afo tv so ni na anti lgbt q plus q option for somebody ye na kwaso man ga ne mu na e ho asama bro parliament ura e bagbin speak of parliament akasa sa so e na honorable alex afia mike so akasa to tuna dwe mi pa e dia ma ndc fo na fe so no en kofobia o mukasa editate e busan fo nya asam keto sa so na abre fo afaya pa enya asam keto kra na ni na mu edu munche mu every life e wo afu tv subscribe like comment share na fe no bi bi antumi ko so kama pa emfa mo yenko ensam no enche wo baka ya parliament e na adwe se je se anti lgbtq je se o ya dia o mai bi bi ewi enti akasa e betun dia ko mampeni ni enti mampeni etumi asan and no, I'm unfortunate. Say, hmm, aye, man, penny, dear, and you're doing to me a sign. Hmm, cries and say, and they are some knock of court in the courts, and they be to me adding. It declares a say, and see, say, and some just a man, penny adding it to me adding inside their chassis. And no, and I'm gonna for be chess, eh, not the assembly, no, then assembly, no, honorable, just say. Babin, I didn't see me to judge. I said, There's no just a parliament, then a cosso. Just say, MP for your virtue, or more just say, or sank ye, or more common, I just want penny one or job to me, which I'm for into me ambassador. Sansa, LGBT, and some seminal. And I appreciate now, Nanny Abre for fire. Young question, good in some Nanny Abre for Ed Tubia, Ed Fasa, and some seminal. Nay, you are judiciary, you are parliament, and they are executive. They come immediately after executive. Not judiciary, I attend. And until now, my speaker, I know I am number two. Now, speaker, I am number three, but I know I am number two. The image so we until now, I know I am number two. Is the executive, until president, never is now is in the executive. Then you come to parliament, so he makes him number two. In fact, speaker to me, the president, man, yeah, yeah, because when the president is out and the vice president is out. The speaker becomes the president. Ministers, deputy ministers, 22, no, I won't no, and cut, Wamu, Kwananka, Wamako, eh, na Wamu to me, a pass, Wamu, na and Yumrano, Wamako, president, or Niaswami, and now I'm running at you, say you can do, say yes, you too, say ya bado, say ya do, Nina Kakem, and Yama, and also a year, Wamu, say Clark Ben, and Juma. Now, also, I can say one sign him running because I said no court will be the court court in the court. Eddie, a tabo battle so near the Dientia. Let us say, I dear, what is a sadia? Eddie, the fear my po. One also the court court, select a mudiba parliament, say, Yan found that ministers, no, and a salad or how home. A two dim rasso, Musu dim rasso. A ten years, I a yo, de yo, quasem, surrado. Womunyan pass it. In fact, the other she grabbed us a crown no fast or packet packet in Yama. Wash your money, say, no wash your money, say, no packet, no idea, then I said, I'm not sure I'm saying, should we are not saying, I'm sorry, Yapon. Ah, speak up, I say. What the idea, even Sanka, the Fiamma Pondi and Ukradia, send your cabins, Bakumi and Umi and Sabiwa, Kibeti, and also in the court. And was a man, Mina, yes, we can see up. Mosai coffee. And nature, just say, Honorable Alex Afino Marken, just say, on a soccer can I dream pa, what can I do with your four? I say, you wouldn't be massy, Eddie, and my yak, and this is four, and then Crophobia Mokasaka say, Tia, my penny, his excellency. Then I had a dunk of good just almost say, I do a year near crime, and then somebody wishing for Honorable Alex Afino Marken, so fire. And go here and go to someone so at two years. The speaker expresses his agreement regarding the content of the said letter. Unfortunately, Mr. Speaker went beyond expressing this, this, this agreement and rather pronounced judgment on what in his view was wrong. Mr. Speaker did not only stop there, he also used very unsavory words to describe Mr. President. We believe that in a democracy, we have a right to disagree on views expressed, but we do not have right to say things to denigrate another. This, we think, is very unacceptable. Now, let me go get into the main issue. Mr. Speaker said that Mr. President was undermining democracy and that he should have resorted to the constitution 
in making certain communications to the House. We in the majority beg to disagree on the position taken by him. If you carefully read the letter that was sent to Parliament, Mr. President limited himself to the processes before the court. And the fact that Parliament itself, through an affidavit, had joined issues. Parliament has filed an affidavit in opposition, and it's in court. In fact, Parliament is a party to the suit. So for us, we do not see how this would have to affect the proceedings of Parliament. Let me also express disappointment at the conduct of the minority. Is it the case that they were aware of what was going to happen? Is it the case that they would always see no evil and say no evil? Is it the case that they are in support of this action to obstruct government business? They should remember that the people of Ghana are watching. We have ministers who are supposed to manage ministries, to conduct public business for the benefit of the people of Ghana. What the minority has done today clearly shows that they are not on the side of democracy. Indeed, they want government business to come to a halt through their conduct because they were nowhere ready to get us to even engage Mr. Speaker. They were ready to pack and get to their various cars and go home. Obviously, it is a political journey they are on. They want to explore the situation to their advantage. And we believe that the good people of Ghana at the right time will know that we as MPP in government stand for progress, development, and the betterment of our democracy. Ladies and gentlemen, let me also say that in the instance case of the Human Sexual Rights and Family Values Bill 2024, President Akufuado has taken a strange and alien position which is unknown to the Constitution of the Republic of Ghana. Ladies and gentlemen, I wish to conclude by saying that the Right Honorable Speaker has made an important call, a call for Parliament to unite against the autocratic tendencies of our president and this government. Yeah. Yeah. We in the NDC minority is ready to protect the sanctity of the constitution of the Republic of Ghana. And we stand with the Speaker of Parliament in this. Yeah. Yeah. Let the president of Ghana and his government be aware that where this country is going is strange under his watch. And the NDC minority will not countenance it. But I want to urge that it is obvious that His Excellency the President has breached the Constitution. And we will advise ourselves. Yeah. In the coming days, don't be surprised that we will begin impeachment proceedings yeah. against the President. Yeah. Thank you very much. Any of you subscribe, like, comment, share from our food TV. Now, if you be able to come up and for a more affordable day, I will have the movie Bia and to share the cost of Bia and I wish you for now. Would you be able to come up at the more? I mean, come.